Marcus Jones one step closer to clemency. The Oklahoma Pardon and Parole Board voting today to recommend Jones receive life in prison with the possibility of parole. Jones was sentenced to a death for the killing of Paul Howell back in 1999. He was set to be executed later this month. 2 News Oklahoma reporter Katie Kelleher shares what happened during this meeting and what is next. Katie. This hearing was the first time Jones has spoken out in public about being convicted of killing Paul Howell. He continues to maintain his innocence while Howell's family says Jones is guilty. My vote is yes to recommend clemency. Clemency is recommended. In a three to one vote, the Oklahoma Pardon and Parole Board voted to recommend Julius Jones receive life in prison with the possibility of parole. Jones was convicted and sentenced to death for killing Paul Howell in 1999. Monday's clemency hearing marked the first time Jones has spoken out about his case. Wednesday, July 28, 1999 was the beginning of the end of my life. Jones maintains he's innocent. He says he was hanging around the wrong people and made mistakes, but had nothing to do with Howell's murder. I am not the person responsible for taking Mr. Howell's life. I was not involved in the planning of this robbery. I was not present during this robbery, and I did not know that anyone had been killed until the day after Mr. Howell was murdered. Several of Howell's family members were also on hand for the clemency hearing, calling on the board to look at the facts of the case, which they say point to Jones as the man who killed Howell. Jones did this out of greed and for personal profit. He has never apologized or acknowledged his participation. Jones knew his punishment for murder. He chose his outcome. Jones' case has received national attention, with many calling for his release, saying he's innocent. In their testimony Monday, Howell's family says the attention is re-victimizing their family, and they want Jones held responsible. Julius Jones is still a physical threat to society. Julius Jones has shown absolutely no remorse for his involvement in actions in Paul's murder, despite overwhelming evidence. This decision now goes to Governor Kevin Stitt. His office tells us he will not make a comment until he's made his decision. Katie Kelleher, 2 News, Oklahoma.